Hey, what's happening, ladies and gentlemen? Stephen Davidson here in this shave video. I've got about four days worth of beard growth, give or take. So let's get started. Going with my Omega, the soap killer. And as you can see, I've already face leathered and prepped my beard with it. The soap killer, my Omega 10049 Professional Bore Killer Brush. Had that thing for five years now. Going with a Rockwell 6C with a number two base plate and a fresh Gillette 7 o'clock yellow, which is about like a drill up track two. And the star of today's party, and it's been a minute, a good minute, Soap Commander Vision. Aqua, Amber, and Mint. Very nice, refreshing scent. No menthol in this, but it feels like it is because of the mint. And to put it over the top, I'm going to fish it off with the matching aftershave balm. Which does have menthol in it. And it needs that little extra oomph. So let's wet the face. Just got out of the shower, so everything's nice and hydrated. And I've had a very, very long day. I went and bought me some pro, uh, 14 foot pole pruners and put them to work today, along with some shears, the large expandable ones. Trimmed up some of these bushes and whatnot to keep me. Thorn burst did get me a little bit, but no well. All right, and also tuned up my weedy. Got to looking at my straight razors, and it's time to upgrade. And I'll be darn. My collection. I hate it when the brush does that. There we go. I may have to do that between passes. So, anyway, back to what I was saying. I'm going to have to upgrade my straight razor collection. The gold dollar at 66 is about gone, and I've just had it for a very short time, where I've been trying to find what age works for me. But then now that I have, it's time to step up my collection. So I'll be going on eBay and on the Prowl and see what I can find next couple of paydays or so. So I'm wanting a very, very nice premium vintage razor. Touch more water than that. See my buddy Tim Shaw is enjoying himself down in New Orleans. Hope you got to see the French Quarter, Tim. The food there is just off the page. There is no bad food in New Orleans, and if there is, it's gone usually within two to three weeks. Lots of chefs go there. From around the world, go there. Uh, yogurt, anyone? Check that out. Nice, huh? This is also a cold water shave. So, anybody that's in the culinary world, going to culinary school, and wanting to be a top shelf chef, I'm going to tell you something. Bring your A game if you go to New Orleans area. You got food from around the world in that whole entire area. French Quarter, uh, some local favorites, all kinds of good stuff. All right, let's check out this Rockwell, the number two base plate. All right. Nice. These are a little bit more tuggy than the greens. But 
not too much. Mm -hmm. I am dog tired. It's about 20 to midnight here on the East Coast as I record this. I've been at it all day today. Oh, and uh, thanks for the shout out, Tim. I couldn't be more proud of myself for that accomplishment. Sometime this week, I'll be going to Virginia Highlands when I get the chance to see what they can do for me down there. Very nice first pass. This ranks up. <clears throat> Man, this, the mint in this feels so good and very soothing after a long day. It really does. Mm. Heel spurs give me a fit. All right, money pass. There I had a brush here. Just recently just subscribed to my to the faces channel. You guys should really check him out. He does some great straight razor shave videos. Very entertaining. Very entertaining guy. I'll put the link to his channel below so you guys should really check him out.
strike on uh, Gillette 7 o'clock yellow. This will be the last shave with that blade. In that razor. Pretty smooth, but still got a lot behind. Yeah, that def that blade's definitely in order to go. Also considering getting an old favorite of mine back in my collection, too, my DE. And that would be the old Edwin Jagger DE-89. And Ken Sears have been using a very brand new razor that's not even available to the public. They showed him dropping it. They've upgraded their construction process. And uh, Razor Rocks MJ-90 sold out. Oh, goodness. Reload the puck. Okay. That brush is eating soap. Oh, if you're wondering, this soap, this specific puck of soap, five years old. And it won't die. Yet I've killed several of theirs old. Figure that one out, right? Okay, third and final pass. Both my viewer suggestions actually work. Pretty cool. I forget which viewer it was that told me, but uh, he suggested that I do across the grain on the money pass under my mustache area, and then on my final pass, go against the grain. It made a whole lot easier. He was right. It worked.
Let's rinse off and get some alum going. That was pretty good, pretty darn smooth. Nice, very nice. I think I'd do better with another blade choice. I think I'll go with a fresh seven o'clock green instead. That, that blade was nice. The yellow's not so much. So. Okay. Mega Grazer's Ellen Black. Minor feedback from the Ellen Black, not a lot. I'm gonna Let's recap. Let the home do its thing. We went with the Omega 10049 Professional Bowler, the Soap Killer. <coughs> I went with the Rockwell 6C. Number two base plate, and I had a fresh 7 o'clock yellow first and last shave on this blade. And the star of today's party was Maggard Raiders, uh, Maggard Raiders, So Commander's Vision, which is an aqua, amber, and mint scents, very minty, fresh type scent. And I'm going to fish it off with the matching nectar shape bomb, which adds a touch of menthol to the equation. So let me rinse it in. I also had a request while I'm thinking about it and it off to do a full blown full tail honing session with all my stones, full blown progression. So, first chance I get, I'm going to do just that. Really slick. Imagine that shape bone. Just a little bit's all you need, not a lot. Soap commander's bombs are great for sensitive skin. It's just something about them. I think they got the best texture shape bomb on the, in the world. And that'll do it, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Take care and God bless. See you on the next shave. Later.